Greetings, it is I, the Great One himself, Cynical Libertarian Society, C-Y-N-L-I-V-S-O-C.com on the interwebs, here with an anarchy moment. And oh, have I got one for you right now. So some shit shows up in my in blah, 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 this person about, yeah, here's some social, social media stats. I think things are kind of fishy. Check the blah, blah, blah. So I go, I look, we're over here. We're on a website called Business Insider. And this post is called Revealed in all capital letters, of course, because old people love to type in all, in all capital letters, right? The fucking old people love that shit. Revealed in all capital letters, the demographic trends for every social network. Ooh, for every social network, everyone on the planet. All right, anyway, here's the point. We get down here. It says, here are a few of the key takeaways from the BI intelligence report. First one here says, Facebook still skews significantly female. Women in the U.S. are more likely to use Facebook than men by about 10 percentage points, according to a 2013 survey of social network adoption. Okay, that's fine. Now we get down here. It says, Twitter has begun to lean worryingly toward male users. Whereas previously it was a more gender balanced social network, Pew found that 22% of men use Twitter while only 15% of women do. So you see the fact that women are more likely to use Facebook than men, well, there's nothing there to worry about. No, of course not. But because more men are using Twitter, we have to worry about this. And for those of you out there who don't fucking get why I constantly rag on feminism, feminazis, femistatism, the femisimping, the white knighting, how I talk about how this country, how our entire society in the United States is geared towards making certain that no upper middle class white woman ever experiences discomfort. This is why. This is exactly it. So women are more likely to use Facebook. Totally fucking okay. Why? Because everything in our society revolves around women. But oh my God, men, more men than women use Twitter. This is something to worry about. This, we must be worried. This is why I'm just fucking sick of constantly everything around me, everything in society around me, everything you say, everything you do, every fucking law. You know, we need free health. We need free birth control. We got to have time off for women to have babies. Women have to get paid money to make babies for other women. All this shit that I have talked about over and over and over, Brie Bolin and her fucking Brianne Bolin on here whining about how, you know, just every fucking place you look in this country, there's some goddamn upper middle class white woman whining about how everybody else on the planet Earth isn't kissing her ass enough. And so this, this is something to worry about men because there's more men on Twitter than women. This is so fuck. Gar I, you know, the thing is, if this comes to the attention of Obama, he'll give a fucking speech and say there ought to be a motherfucking law. This, this fucking just, you know, and, and all you fuckers want to talk about institutionalized racism and all this other, how about the institutionalized ass kissing of women in our society, the way they are just, and, and they are, I mean, and again, this comes back to why I regard women as incompetent for the most part. I mean, this is, this is a motherfucking upper middle class white woman first world problem is that there's more men on Twitter than women. In other countries, 14-year-old girls are being gang raped. But here in the United States, you fucking cunts are so goddamn privileged that the fact that there's more men on Twitter than women is something that needs to be worried about.